Hello my fellow gamers, I am Milad and you're watching Apex Alpha. First of all, this is my first commentary video ever, so please forgive me for the lack of quality and quantity of any kind. I apologize in advance for any inconvenience and stuttering and things I don't even know yet. Thanks for watching. So. As the title suggests, I'm going to talk about Acceleration and speak in Forza Horizon 5. By Acceleration I mean Drag Race and by Speed I mean Top Speed. There are several factors to talk about here, but in today's video we are talking about cars and in the upcoming videos I will explain custom tuning and custom upgrade. So now, we are going to talk about the best cars for Acceleration and Speed. This is actually the most important part of the whole process because no matter how good you are at tuning and upgrading and even driving you are not going to win any drag race without a proper car you are not going to make or create an unsuitable car good for drag race today i will introduce five completely different cars with five different specifications Three of these cars have internal combustion engines, which means they use gasoline, and the other two cars are basically electric cars. And if you like this video, I will make another video, and in that specific one, I will talk about a bunch of different cars too. Number one. One of the fastest cars in Forza Horizon 5 universe is Dodge Dart Hemi Super Stock 1968. Actually, this is my most favorite car in today's list. Dodge Dart is and always was an illustration of power and speed in Forza Horizon series. It's a very beautiful car with a very beautiful design. This car, even without a proper tune, can beat most of the cars in a drag race. But with a couple of upgrades and changes, we can make it an unbeatable car across all categories and classes. As you can see, it's acceleration and speed performance in the bottom left of your screen. 0 to 97 km per hour is 0 0.858 seconds. 0 to 161 km per hour in 2.468 seconds. Top speed is 410 km per hour. Number 2. The second car is Porsche Taycan Turbo S Welcome Pack 2020 version. There are two different types of Porsche Taycan Turbo S in this game, but we are specifically talking about the Welcome Pack version, because this is the superior car when it comes to tuning. In both fields of acceleration and speed, this is far more superior car than the other one. And as you probably know, this is an electric car, at the bottom left, you can see the performance. The records are 0 to 97 km per hour in 0 0.803 seconds, 0 to 161 km per hour in 2.551 seconds, with a top speed of 431.6 km per hour. It is one of the fastest cars in Forza Horizon 5. You see, all the Porsche Taycan Turbo S is faster at 0 to 100. It's a little bit slower at 0 to 161 km per hour, which in comparison to Dodge Dart Hemi Super Stock 1968, making it better at initial launch, but weaker at higher speeds. I will explain more later. Number 3. The next car is Ford Mustang RTR Spec 5 2018. This special car is designed and built for drifting, but with a couple of changes we are going to make a beast. This monstrosity of a car is an insane car when it comes to acceleration in higher speeds. Let me explain. For instance, pick Dodge Dart Hemi Super Stock 1968. It's a great car when it comes to initial launch, just like Porsche Taycan. But when you are talking about secondary acceleration, that's where cars like Ford Mustang RTR Spec 5, Remac Concept 2, and Koenigsegg Yesco shines. You can see its performance in the bottom left of your screen. 0 to 97 km per hour in 1.186 seconds. 
0 to 161 kilometers per hour in 2.692 seconds. And the top speed is 450.5 kilometers per hour. It means it takes Ford Mustang RTR Spec 5 1.506 seconds to reach to 161 kilometers per hour from 97 kilometers per hour. But for Dodge Dart Hemi, it takes 1.61 seconds. Number four, the next car is Rimac Concept 2 2019. This is another electric car in today's list. This is actually the best known car in real life alongside with cars like Dodge Demon, Bugatti Chiron, even Tesla Model S and etc. when it comes to drag race. Remember, each of these cars have their own capabilities and specifications, their weaknesses and their superiorities. For instance, when we are talking about initial launch, probably the best car in today's list is Porsche Taycan Turbo S or maybe Dodge Dart. But when it comes to acceleration in higher speeds, there's no car that comes toe to toe with Rimac Concept 2. Rimac Concept 2, with its insane torque and power, will practically keep on accelerating from zero to the top speed with a constant acceleration ratio. And that's why no one else is going to come close to this car in a drag race. With a performance of 0 to 97 km per hour in 1.102 seconds, 0 to 161 kilometers per hour in 2.749 seconds. Top speed is 422.6 kilometers per hour. Number five. And finally, the next and the last car in today's list is Koenigsegg Esco 2019. The performance records are 0 to 97 kilometers per hour in 1.602 seconds. 0 to 161 kilometers per hour in 2.617 seconds. Top speed is 488.1 kilometers per hour. Okay, so with all these informations, we are easily going to decide which one is better. Well, we can't. Why? The reason is because they are so different in initial and secondary acceleration. And because of that, we can't easily understand which one is better overall. Let's review again. In today's list, the fastest car in 0 to 97 km per hour is undoubtedly Porsche Taycan Turbo S Welcome Pack Edition. The fastest car in 0 to 161 km per hour is Dodge Dart Hemi Superstock 1968. The fastest car in 97 to 161 km per hour is Koenigsegg Yesco 2019. It means it takes only 1.015 seconds for Yesco to reach to 161 km per hour from 97 km per hour. But in the same scenario, it takes 1.61 seconds for Dodge Dart. It would be much easier for me to explain all of this if we had the car's records from 0 to 300 km per hour. Because with that information, you can easily see the huge difference between these cars. Let me put it in perspective for you. Now, these informations are all about the time, but not distance. And in a drag race, a combination of time, distance and speed decides which car is the winner. These are all about physics, and this is not a physics classroom. Okay, let's see the results. After analyzing all of these information and numbers, according to my knowledge and experience, it is safe to say Rimac Concept 2 is the best car when it comes to drag racing in all of drag race tracks in Forza Horizon 5 world. You can easily win pretty much every car in Forza Horizon 5 with Rimac Concept 2 with a huge margin. But if you are going to play with random players that you don't know and you don't know their cars, I will recommend Porsche Taycan Turbo West Welcome Pack Edition for very short distances and Koenigsegg Yesco for very long distances like 
highway roads or long straight roads because you can easily reach to insane speeds with this car. And remember, Koenigsegg Esco is one of the best cars when it comes to handling in high speeds.